ಆರ್ಟಿಕಲ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಥಾಟ್ಸ್ ಆನ್ ವೇದಾಂತ ಬೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಸಚ್ಚಿದಾನಂದೇಂದ್ರ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಸ್ವಾಮೀಜಿ ಹೊಳೆಂದ್ರ ಸಿಬ್ಬರು ದಿಸ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸೀನ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ಆರ್ಟಿಕಲ್ಸ್ ಟು ಡೇಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ತರ್ಟಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಆರ್ಟಿಕಲ್ ಓಂ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಹರಿ ಓಂ ಶ್ರೀ ಗಣೇಶ ನಮಃ ನಾಲೆಜ್ ಆಫ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ the reader has so far seen that knowledge of brahman according to badarayana as interpreted by shankara is that which culminates in final intuition this intuition is the highest goal of human life as it does away with all the ills of transmigratory life such as avidya brahma avagatirhi purushartha nishesha samsara bija avidya avidya dhyanartha nibarhana unlike upasana it is not something to be enjoyed we have now to see some other characteristics of this knowledge one another feature of this knowledge is that unlike karma or upasana which is something to be done it does not depend upon the will of a person but only on the nature of an entity brahman which already is there na vastu yathatmya jnanam ಪುರುಷ ಬುದ್ಧ್ಯಪೇಕ್ಷಂ ಕಿಂ ತರ್ಹಿ ವಸ್ತುತಂತ್ರಮೇ ವತತ್ ಎಗೆ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಎನಿ ಸೆ ಆಕ್ಷನ್ ಎನಿ ಆಕ್ಷನ್ ಸೆಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಆರ್ ವೇದಿಕ್ ಬೀಯಿಂಗ್ ಡಿಪೆಂಡೆಂಟ್ ಆನ್ ಎ ಪರ್ಸನ್ಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಫಿಟ್ನೆಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಇಂಜಂಕ್ಷನ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಪ್ರೊಹಿಬಿಷನ್ಸ್ ವುಡ್ ಸರ್ವ್ ಸಮ್ ಪರ್ಪಸ್ ಇನ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಕೇಸ್ ವಿಧಿ ಪ್ರಶ್ ಪ್ರತಿಷೇಧಾಚ್ಚ ವಿಧಿ ಪ್ರತಿಷೇಧಾಶ್ಚ ಅತ್ರ ಅರ್ಥವಂತ ಸ್ಯೂ ಬಟ್ ನಾಲೆಜ್ ಆಫ್ ಅನ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಡಿಪೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಆಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಡಸ್ ಸೋಲಿ ಆನ್ ದಿ ನೇಚರ್ ಆಫ್ ಎ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಕೆನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಸೋ ಎಂಜಾಯ್ಡ್ ಆರ್ ಪ್ರೊಹಿಬಿಟೆಡ್ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಒನ್ ಎಗೇನ್ ಆಲ್ಟರ್ನೇಟ್ ಕೋರ್ಸಸ್ ಜನರಲ್ ರೂಲ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಷನ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ವಿಕಲ್ಪೋತ್ಸರ್ಗಪವಾದಶ್ಚ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ಲಿ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಕರ್ಮ ಸಚ್ ಆಸ್ ಲಿಬ್ ಲಿಬೇಷನ್ is sometimes allowed in the veda to be performed in one way for some and quite an, in another way for others but the knowledge of the truth of an existing entity like brahman cannot allow of alternatives no one thing no one thing can be alternatively conceived to be such and not such or that is and is not na vastu evam naivam asti nasti iti va vikalpyate for alternative views are solely dependent on a person's will but the truth of a thing is solely dependent on the real nature of the thing to be known it is obvious therefore that the nature of reality cannot be supposed to be dualistic or non dualistic or a combination of both it is not correct therefore to say that all systems of philosophy may be right each being true from a different standpoint as shankara rightly remarks nahi sthana vekasmin sthanaruva purusho anyo veti tatva jnanam bhavati it cannot be a correct view of a post to suppose that it might be a post or a person fourth one again brahman is taught to be one's own atman in the upanishads i am atma brahma and being the inmost atman of every creature sarva bhutantara atma and witness the sakshi of everything as well as devoid of all characteristics nirgunascha it does not stand to reason to think that it is an object of thought as a matter of fact the shruti is to teach that brahman is no object of the act of knowing anya deva tad vidita datho avidita adhi keno upanishad it is quite other than the known and above what is unknown much less is it the object of meditation enjoyed by the shruti for there is the shruti itself emphatically negating that what is enjoined to be meditated upon is not the real brahman for brahman's consciousness objectifies everything yadvachana bhyuditam jena vag bhyudyate tadeva brahmatvam vidhi nedam yadidam upasate keno upanishad that which is not expressible by speech but that which objectifies the speech itself know that to be brahman and not this which they meditate upon the knowledge of brahman therefore is quite unlike the knowledge of empirical objects or of vedic duties the only way to know it is only way to know it is to intuit it as unknowable vijnatam avijanatam more of this in the next article 32nd one knowledge of brahman we have seen in the last article that knowledge of brahman being no action 
like karma or upasana is dependent neither upon some vedic injunction or prohibition nor upon the will of a person but is just like the knowledge of an external object solely dependent on the nature of what is revealed uh, to wit brahman as such this knowledge does not admit of any alternative views we have seen too that this knowledge cannot objectify brahman like the knowledge of external phenomena for brahman is the very self of the knower himself and being devoid of all characteristics is quite inexpressible by words and unthinkable by thought it follows therefore that no scientific observation or experimentation can be expected to make any research with regard to brahman's nature at any distant future in some distant place there is another peculiar feature to be remembered in connection with this knowledge brahman is not the individual self of any one person the upanishads describe it as satyam jnanam anantam brahma pure being pure consciousness and infinite therefore when it is intuited as the inquirer's self the inquirer himself will have ceased to be a knower distinct from brahman and there is no possibility of there being anything second to the infinite brahman time and space will also be absorbed also uh, have been absorbed into brahman shankara says that the vedanta shastra is a pramana means of knowledge not because it describes or defines brahman to be such and such but because it abolishes all distinctions like that of the knowable known and knowledge conjured up by the ignorance it only reveals brahman as no object that is all an upanishadic text describes the truth about brahman as follows ब्रह्मै वेदम अमृतम पुरस्ता ब्रह्म पश्चात ब्रह्म दक्षिणतश्चोत्तरेण अधश्चोर्ध्वञ्च प्रसृतम ब्रह्मै वेदम विश्वमिदम वरिष्ठम मुंडकोपनिषद् दिस इन फ्रंट ऑफ अस इज वेरीली ब्रह्मन अलोन व्हाट इज बिहाइंड इज ब्रह्मन अलोन टू द राइट एंड टू द लेफ्ट इज ब्रह्मन अलोन बिफोर एंड अबव इज ब्रह्मन अलोन दैट इज ऑल परवेडिंग ऑल दिस इज ब्रह्मन द बेस्ट next article we have the truth and error we shall see this in the next session hare ram sarve jana sukhino bhavantu loka samasta sukhino bhavantu shri 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 sachidananda indra saraswati charanar vindar pitamastu adi shankar bhagavad pada puja charanar vindar pitamastu om tat sat brahma arpanamastu